Good morning. We are back with Night in the Woods. Uh, we did a lot of running around yesterday, and now we are going to a party. So I'm wondering if this is going to be the actual Night in the Woods of the title, the titular Night in the Woods, as it were. So let's see. Okay, okay, okay. It's go time. Oh, I should probably make sure I don't look like a cave beast. Cave beast. Oh, no, 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 no. This keeps drawing me in. <laughs> the computer. It keeps making me think that there's something I was supposed to do there. No sleep. Party time. Gotta get ready. Morning, Sunny. How are you doing this morning? Ooh, I am looking all right. <laughs> so I can either say that my shirt makes me look fat or that I have the worst face. Goodness. Hey, Sazzy. How are you doing this morning? This shirt accentuates my roundness, doesn't it? I think the round zero doesn't help. It is very interesting. I, as you can see, I'm just on my second. I've probably got about two hours in it. Uh, it's it's interesting, yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry, Sunny. I'm so sorry. You have your counseling today, don't you? It's cool, dude. Round is okay. Oh, thank you, Sunny. I'm being body positive like the internet. Well, I hope that your everything going on in your house lets you uh, take a chill day. I'm a real live person, and no one can prove I'm not. You can do this, people like you. Oh, people like you. <laughs> Good. <laughs> you can do this, people like you. All right, so she can either say people don't, I don't like people or people don't like me. Wow, that's not very positive. Uh, you don't like people, clearly. Just because that online test said that your best chance at being happy is a situation where everyone already likes you, but they mostly leave you alone. I think that would be me. <laughs> <laughs> Except when they're delivering food to you, that doesn't mean you but that doesn't mean you can hide in your room and wait for that to happen. That's how hermits are made, May. <laughs> and they die alone in the middle of winter. All right, well, Sazzy, I think we will not die alone in the middle of the winter. It's because we like to be left alone. <laughs> and I don't have any cats, so no one will eat me if I do. <laughs> Waiting for pizza from friends they don't want to see. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Who cares if Cole is there? Jerk. Okay, Cole is a previous boyfriend as far as we can tell. Prom. Okay, so here's another true life. Prom was a mistake in like 10 different ways. And let me just say, I'm 61 and I can still think back and prom was definitely a mistake. That dress. No, I looked, I looked good. That picture under that doorway flower thing. Less slow dancing than slow standing. <laughs> Careful non-touching, no smooches. I'm so glad. I, oh, yeah, like times a million. I'm so glad I'm not a teenager anymore. All right, I'm laughing so hard I'm crying. Um, my breath tastes like tacos. Oh, yeah, because we had taco tacos downstairs. Junior, senior banquet. Really? You mean so you all just came in and ate together? That's criminal, Sonny. That is criminal. This is a disaster. All right, what are you going to say? May, how's it going? Really? That's fascinating. That is so true. Well, see you later. Okay, good. That sounds normal. 
Oh, you had a little footloose action going on in high school, huh? <laughs> Man, that's kind of brutal. <laughs> no one can prove you're not normal. And really, everyone looks normal in the dark. Yeah, totally. I'm pretty sure that's the only way sex works. Wait a minute. I guess it is a party in the woods at night, huh? Parents were allowed to throw us dances. Well, I'm going to say that is a loophole big enough to drive a truck through. So they were they were kind of skirting some edges of their school board or something there with that one. <laughs> I have never heard of that before, Sunny. That is really interesting. <laughs> this is hopeless. Wheel me out to the curb for garage day. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Doesn't this just bring back so many painful memories? Oh, geez, they'll be here any minute. Good luck, kid. Oh, God, that is so crazy. I wonder if it was like like their funding or something. You know, they were like, all right, we know this is stupid, too, that you can't dance. So we figured out a way to get around it. That's crazy. Good luck, kid. I need to ask my sister about that because she um, was a teacher at a homeschool school, which sounds like crazy, but they have these schools for, you know, like, so you have your science equipment and stuff like that anyway. And she was on the board. She was very involved in it and as a faith-based school. And I need to ask her about that whole, what they did about prom and all that kind of stuff. Now I'm curious if they had the same issues. Okay. Good luck, kid. I don't need luck. I make my own luck well. <laughs> With a luck machine. <laughs> All right, we're heading to the party. Woohoo! Hey, May, I think Cole might be there tonight. That's Greg talking. Yeah, I know. Jeez, sorry. I don't care if he's there. He might not be. Well, let's hope so or not. I don't even know what we're talking about. May and Cole went out. I mean, May and Cole went out in junior year. Yeah, and it didn't work out. So let's stop talking about it. Let's. B's kind of a buzzkill. Yeah, we're going to the party. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, this will be some painful, awful. This brings back memories, too. That was awful. I hate beer. I can't remember the last time I drank beer. It's not a delicious drink at all. I don't know if I should have another drink right now. You just want to yell at me about all the mistakes that you remember yourself making in these similar situations. <laughs> okay, so that's all she's got to say. Let's go talk to some people. Maybe we'll find Cole and get to the bottom of that story. Oh no! It's... I'm guessing this is Cole. Oh no, that was that dude talking to her. He couldn't remember her name. Oh, here's B. What? B doesn't really like us. Nothing. Alright, dude, nobody wants to talk to me! It's the worst party ever! I'm just horrified! I'm humiliated! Hanging out by myself? That's a bummer. Hey, dudes. Yo, did you see Coles here? Oh, no. You okay? Yeah, totally fine. You gonna talk to him? Yeah, of course. Yeah, sure. Yeah, man. You sure, May? Yeah, I mean, why should I be weird about it? Well, I mean, you did write that song afterwards. <laughs> what was it called? Go get dead, Angel Face? Oh, ugh. We don't talk about go get dead, Angel Face. Can you guys believe this dude playing guitar? Yep, playing the douchebag hits. <laughs> I like this song. Is this a douchebag song? Angus is definitely not in the groove. Nah, don't worry, big guy. <laughs> There is a douchebag like this at every party. You have no idea, Greg. 
back in school, you'd always have some frat boy hanging out on the lawn, trying to look all sensitive. Why is this a douchebag song? Yeah, we got nothing else to say to you, Ag Angus. All right, how do we go talk to Cole? I want to get to the bottom of the Cole story. <laughs> Maybe I need another drink. That's all he says. <laughs> this is her saying she doesn't... Oh, I see. This is the keg right here. I didn't even realize. All right, what's happening? Oh, sigh. I guess beer is just one of those horrible things adults do, like taxes and having babies. <laughs> yeah, B doesn't want to talk to us. Yo, what? You're kind of grouchy, did you know that? No, I didn't. Because I'm emo. Rude. How long are you planning on staying? May, we just got here like 10 minutes ago. Oh. Are you... How many beers have you had? Like in 10... Good morning, Maruski. You did not... I did not know you were here this morning yet. Good morning, my friend. We are at the party, doing high school things. Well, I guess in her case, college things. Oh, maybe we can't go any farther than this. We'll have to go out into the woods. Ugh. Thank you, Sunny. Problem. Sometimes I think I just don't like people. Yeah, man. F the world. <laughs> yeah, F it. Someone really should just F the world already. Man, she is like down on this party right now. The world has gone uneft for too long. <laughs> F it right. <laughs> Did you guys hear something? Like what? Something in the woods over there. Oh, I knew we were going in the woods. Yeah, two people are making out on the rock behind us. Well, that can't be very comfortable. Who needs comfort when you have makeouts? Yeah, there's high school for you. But preferably you have both. Yeah, exactly. It ain't a perfect world, Angus. They really are going at it up there. Did I freeze? What do you mean? Is my stream stuck? What do you mean, uh, Mariski? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they sure are. Man, I'm glad we don't have sound o vision. Okay. On uh, the making out. I don't want to hear that. You guys want to, I don't know, stand somewhere else? Yeah, exactly. Nah, dude. Why should we move? They're the indecent ones. <laughs> we are gentlemen. Well, if you were gentlemen, you would move. I'm starting to feel those two beers. Yeah, I don't really drink much. I only had one beer before. Ah, yeah, and spit it out. May, if you don't drink, you really should be careful. No, oh, man, I'm cool. Okay, well, we'll keep an eye on you. We will watch you like hawks. Chaperone hawks. Thanks, dudes. All right, we're going to go out in the woods. Oh, I guess we can't. <laughs> we can only go that far. This party's kind of a bummer. Yep, they're still making out. I wonder if we can go farther the other way. <laughs> hey! May, is that you? Wow, how are you? Hi, I'm May. How's it going? <laughs> I just asked you that. I mean, I'm fine. Just back visiting for the weekend. I'm guessing this is Cole right here, maybe. Really? That's fascinating. I guess. I think that's the first time in a while anyone has... Oh, any, first time in a while anyone has called my life fascinating. That is so true. You can tell she's all nervous. That is so true. Well, see you later. Uh, okay. What the hell is your problem? What? Oh, I've, my thing says I have an excel, excellent connection. I don't know, you guys.
Oh, I see. I saw it buffering there a bit. It's showing that I have an excellent connection, so I don't know why we're having buffering problems. I'm sorry about that. Well, let's go on and see how we see how we go. What? Be cool, May. Go get a drink and be cool. I don't want to get another drink. Be cool, May. Go get a drink and be cool. Maybe I have to. Maybe that's the whole idea is that she gets like totally drunk at this party. Yeah, that looks like that's my only other option. Oh, no. can I go that way? No. Okay. I can't go up there, so I guess we're just going to get drunk and bad things are going to happen to us. Now I've had three beers in like ten minutes. Screw it. I'm doing two beers. I'm doing beer. I still taste tacos. Okay. What? Nothing. I don't know if I should have another drink right now. Okay. Ugh, I don't know if I can do this. Okay, so that is coal, I guess. It's getting darker. Hey, Greg! Whoa, dude! You okay, May? Do you think the people make it out on that rock met up there because there's a porn log? Oh, <laughs> Oh my gosh, I bet there is a what? You see, it's a log where olden days people would put porn. How old are we talking? These woods are full of old ghosts and porn logs and people making out. <laughs> hey, Angie, my dad knows your dad. They used to work together back in the 80s. Okay. He used to hang out at the bar with your daddy. Okay, she's getting obnoxious now. Dude, don't ever say daddy again. Psst. What? My dad had to stop drinking because he was a danger to me and my mom. Uh-oh. Ha ha ha. Yeah, May's getting drunk. Dude. Okay, May, you're not allowed to drink anymore. Ever. Okay, May, I'm a little worried about you. We failed at being chaperone hawks, clearly. Someday, Bug. What? Aw. Oh, I forgot you called him Bug. Well, I'm having a great time here in the woods, okay? Greg, don't you think maybe May should sit down? Yeah, dude, you should sit. Dude, sit down by the fire and chill, okay? You're no fun, party poopers. We'll just sit here and jam. Yeah, the music's a little gentle. Hey, May! Hey, Coolio Cool 10? Oh, Cold 10. Wow, haven't heard that in forever. It's been like three years. That's not long at all. Well, it was good to see you. I'm just back for a couple of days from school and... Shut up already! What? We never even kissed. Didn't we? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! No, not successfully. I'm sorry? I don't even care! That girl at the video store is all like, Woo-woo, cute boys! And you're a cute boy, Cole. Oh, thanks, May. I... But I hate cute people. Cute is the worst. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. And it's not my fault. I'm a total trash fire. May? I got nightmare eyes. And the last thing you sh... Wait, what? And the last thing you see is my eyes outside the window. And then I... S stab you with my knife. Stab, stab, stab! Boom! Dead! Then the pol when the police get there, you're all nightmare eyes! Uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> New nickname. So don't F with me, kid! F the world. 
Okay, May, you're threatening people now. No, B, this is me being body positive. I know what's happening. Read the internet. May, I think you need to F college. Yeah. All those rich kids and hot people all writing sex and having papers with each other. <laughs> Close enough. And that damn statue pointing at me every day? Supposed to be the founder, but just shapes. I, yeah, May is a total drunk. I'm a total trash mammal. And nothing is ever going to work out. We never had a chance here. But I can't go anywhere else. I'm home again. And I can do something besides sleep and cry alone. Erp. <laughs> because things aren't just things here, you know? Oh, God. I'm so sick to death. Does that make sense, Cole 10? May, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. I think you're a really great home again. Woo. Bah. Bah. Oh, God. Poor May. Now she won't be able to stay home. Tacos. Oh, yeah. The party was a total disaster. Man, I hate when that happens. If you puke in this car... Oh, so she's only bringing May home. So help me. I owe you an apology, B. I'm sorry. I didn't even know what happened. You got sloppy-ass drunk after, what, three cups of watered-down beer? Well, I thought we didn't know B before. I remember when we hung out as kids... I remember when we were like best friends, B. Remember, you used to call me Mayday, and I called you BB. Oh, you mean when we were like 10? No, I don't. Remember when we were scouts together and we caught that turtle? Yeah, Boxy the turtle. He died. Why are you so mean to me? Why so mean to me? Burp. <laughs> oh man, if I puke in here, your parents are going to be so mad at me. Tell your mom I'm sorry, okay? Because she's so nice. God damn it, May. What? My mother is dead. What? She died of cancer. Senior year. Oh, she was so nice. Jeez. BB, are you okay? How do you not know this? Did you forget about my dead mom? Wait, what? This was a terrible lapse of memory, B. I'm so sorry. I don't like remember anything sometimes. Don't take it personally. What happened to you? You used to be smart. You used to be cool. You used to be worth talking to. <laughs> Why did you even come back? Oh, did college not work out for you? Was it inconvenient? Were you not in the mood? <laughs> I would have killed for that. I still would. I'd kick you out of this moving car right now if it meant I could go to college. Whoa! We're here. Get the hell out of my car. <laughs> oh god let me help you in all right some facts are coming out here there you go somebody is gonna have a bad hangover in the morning i'm guessing i'm sorry b i'm a mess you know what whatever it's not your fault you're just a kid I'm older than you. Two months. Yeah, well, I stayed here and got older. Well, you went off and stayed the same. Wow, it usually happens the other way around, doesn't it? You come back home to your town where you were in high school after you've been away and everyone is stuck in a rut and you've changed. Clearly, that did not happen here. Oh, good, night. good night, Mayday. Oh, she's dreaming now. 
having so oh look at this all right this is kind of cool all right what are we supposed to throw our swing our bat at I wonder if I was supposed to go the other way oh okay here uh Dirk kills Berg. Oh, this is some other town. Oh, we're gonna trash some cars. I hope we're dreaming and not actually doing this. Okay. Now this game, game is bringing back so many, like, bad high school memories. <laughs> Alright, I guess that's as far as we can go that way. This particular thing not being one of them, I certainly never took a bat out and trash stuff. Ooh, let's kill this sign, man. This is not a dream. I'm expecting Mall Cop to come in a minute. Aunt Mall Cop. But I'm assuming it is a dream because we're all blue. <laughs> oh, maybe I should have tried to make it spell something. That would have been cooler than just bashing it out, huh? Ha ha! Dirkelsberg. Whatever that is. Oh, look, I'm up in the tree where I was for a minute. Okay. Didn't seem like anything was very interesting the other way. Let's make sure we got everything this way. And then we'll run back the other way. Alright, let's go back the other way. Well, I hope everybody has fun weekend plans. Whatever those may be. It's funny, even at this point in my life when I'm retired, realizing it and that all my days are basic, pretty much the same, realizing that it's Friday, uh, it's like, woohoo, the weekend. <laughs> that never goes away. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we weren't finished over here. I wonder if we can jump up. You know how I was sort of vaguely in that tree for a minute? No, okay, I guess I wasn't. I thought I was. What else can we do up here? Oh, we, maybe we can go this way up this. Oh, here's something right here to bash up. Maybe we can go up this way. Oh yeah, more stuff to trash. Oh, there we go, boom. All right, now we gotta go back down and knock out the other street lights. Now that I know we can do that. Is that all the street lights? Yeah, okay. Oh no, there's one more over here. We want to get everything that we can possibly trash. We will be trashing it.
Ooh, what was that? What the heck is this? Look at this, it's like a sculpture. Cool. It doesn't seem to be falling apart though. They have a sc Oh, this is at her college! Look, see it said that sculpture pointing at me all the time. I wonder if she actually did this, went around her college town and like bashed everything all up. That would be pretty terrible. So she's having a dream about college. Let's see if we can bash the finger. Evidently not. <laughs> Alright, I feel like we've beat up everything we can beat up here. Didn't I just climb up on this statue a minute ago? Now I don't seem to be able to do it. Oh no, maybe I just did that. Okay, what else is there? No, oh, stop pointing at me! I don't know. I don't know what else we're supposed to do. That's what we're supposed to do. I figured there was something to do with this uh, sculpture. Now I can't get up. Okay. Tearing this statue down. Come on, May, get up. Every time the statue knocks her down, she stays down for a little while. Oh no! Do you think it's gonna spear her when it comes over? gonna find out that she actually did this at school at college like she just trashed her whole town okay that's it we destroyed everything she's gonna wake up with a epic hangover uh, I got the welcome back trophy part two weird autumn Uh, I could just imagine how she's going to feel now. Ugh. Oh, wait. What happened to the big hangover? <laughs> well, that was a weird one. I feel awful. I probably look awful. Ugh. I'm going to burn this room down with me in it. Live out my remaining days as a shrieking ghost. Yep. Never thought, never drink again or go in public. <laughs> Everything feels bad. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, wait, maybe we need to check some emails. Okay, hold on. I just don't want to play that game again. Hey, sorry about last night. Hope you're feeling okay. Um, yep. 
I'm at the pickaxe all day. Oh, that's from B. I'm surprised. If you want to stop by. This is Greg's. Hey, dude. You okay? Last night was P and tens. B said you're okay. I'm at Snack Falcon all day. Come by if you're not dead. Sincerely, Gregory. <laughs> P.S. Band Jam later on. The end. All right. So we do need to check our computer periodically, evidently. All right. Let's go out into the world the day after the party. Afternoon, us. May? Yeah? Come say hi. Okay. Oh no. Hey, hon. You look like crap. <laughs> yep. Rough night. Is it that obvious? Good morning, Chris Kingdom. How are you this morning? Have you played this game before? No, I was just saying you look like crap because I love you. Thanks. If you want to talk about it, it's cool, Mom. Let's see. I saw Cole at a party in the woods. It is pretty. So they were last playing Bramble. Chris was last playing Bramble, but I think she rage quit it. <laughs> so <laughs> what are you going to play next, Chris? <laughs> I saw Cole at a party in the woods. From senior year? Yeah, he was home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Kind of, sort of, I don't know. Well, he's a jerk, huh? Oh, you finished it, good for you! I missed the end, dang it! I don't know how I missed it. Well, good for you! Uh, he's a jerk, hon. No, he's not, or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> and then you got rid of it. You didn't ever want to see it again, huh? I'm on the fence about it after watching you play. When you started it, and it looked so cool, I was like, man, I am playing this right away. And then the further you got in, where it started getting really hard, and I was just like, oh, I don't know about this game. <laughs> Looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out of the town center. Finally. Yeah, they're all done with the Churchill steps and the power lines. Great. Hun. Oh. Uh, I do not want you up on those things. Mom, I'm 20. Uh-huh, which means you go to jail for it. No one is going to jail for running around on the power lines. It happens. Yeah, if the cops have literally nothing else to do. Okay, good point. Aunt Molly would be so delighted to arrest me. She just might. And anyway, it's dangerous. You remember Susie Kushner? Gee, Mom, I sure don't. <laughs> Did you finish it on stream? I don't know how I missed that. I don't, maybe I was out. I, I don't know. I can't believe I missed the end. I definitely never heard this story a thousand times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Man, I'll have to go back and catch the VOD because I can't believe I missed the end. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I missed the end. Now she can't use adjectives. She lost an entire part of speech. <laughs> Gee, mom, that's terrible. So she got electrocuted and she lost her adjectives. <laughs> See, that's the exact kind of sentence Susie can't formulate. So what are you up to today? I don't know. Gonna go see what Greg and B are up to. You all gonna do something together? I don't know. I don't think they hang out much. Past messing around with our old band equipment. Oh, past messing around with our old band equipment. Well, there are only so many hours and so many days in our lives. <laughs> That's hilarious that your mic was off. I couldn't hear you screaming. <laughs> That's pretty funny. 
Is there some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? Friendships are like trees. Uh-huh. You have to water them so they grow. And we each only have so much water. What? Have you ever watered a tree? No, God does that. Oh my gosh, her mom is like too much. Uh, okay, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. Yeah, I'd be out at that point too. F the cops. Thought become a fire ghost and yell. Oh, thought become a fire ghost and yell at people. <laughs> Poor May. I feel bad for her, I, to be honest. She's kind of lost. All right, let's go scope the town now. Still can't go this way. I thought we would never go out again after the way we acted at the party last night. Let's see if everyone's talking about it. Hey, May. Hey, Selmers. Did I see you with a journal the other day? Oh yeah, doctor's orders. Yeah, Dr. Hank has me doing one too. Oh, okay, did you have anger problems too? I was stealing painkillers from the Ham Panther Pharmacy. Oh, yikes. Oh, geez. So Dr. Hank sees journals as a general cure-all? Is it working for you? Nope. Rehab and the program do, though. And I've become a very good poet. Want to hear one? Oh, yeah. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. My heart is a dankness. But when I see you, I feel a thankness. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that, that's really nice. When I feel a blueness, all I need is Eunice. Okay, Sunny. Oh my goodness. Um, that's very romantic. It's about my horse. Oh. We're just friends. Mr. Chazkoff's up on the roof again. Pretty sure he's gonna break his damn neck. Alright, what did we write? Summer's a poet. <laughs> All right, let's go harass this dude up on his porch. Because, you know, it's part of our gig. If he falls through one of my windows, I will not hesitate to take legal action. Who? Him, up there on the roof next door. If he falls from that roof through a window, you're going to have to pick which part of him you're going to sue. Whichever piece is the biggest. I can hear you, you know. I wonder if we can jump on the power lines from here. No, I guess not. Okay, what else is shaking in town? Do, 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 do. Let's go scope the subway situation. Ooh, guys, fishing. Tunnel fish. Many miners, old and young, with home in heart and coal in lung, were taken by the trolley men up to the mine and back again. But mudslide, flood, and awful storm have given tunnel fishes... Oh, wait, what? <laughs> oh, mm. <laughs> Form. Please stop listening. Honey, I'm Horm. <laughs> <laughs> See, it is just like Red Dead Redemption. I can't believe they kept this open. Historical note, I guess. I think it's just because the old people like the pierogi stand. Never underestimate the ability of old people to get state funding. Oh, it's on sale now, huh? Oh, you know, I thought you liked it more. I did not... Uh, I didn't like the uh, demo too much either. I mean, it wasn't terrible, but I didn't love it. I'd be like you. I, I'd just be like, eh, I don't know. A bunch of stuff just came on sale. I need to look and see what's on my wish list that's on sale. Oh, hello. Hey, it's May. I remember old clock upstairs ain't stopped yet. Oh, you know who I think liked it was CNCNZ. I think she really liked it. Yeah, that's how I felt about it. I remember old clock upstairs ain't stopped yet. What did you want to tell me about, Granddad? Well... I'll only say if you really want to know. Haha, ha, yes, I do want to know. 
You got a history of troublemakers in your family, on your daddy's side in particular. Oh? Go back far enough, you got folks that were around for the real hard times, when the workers went up against armies. Oh yeah, I kind of remember something about that. Great, 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 great grandpa or whatever. Might have gotten the number of greats wrong there. Your grandfather and I weren't around for a lot of the violence. That was even, that was before even our time. Nah, we were around to watch the tide roll out and roll back in and then watch it roll away again. And we'll need to talk another time. I get tired. Okay, can I get you anything? I don't have any money. No, I'm just fine, May. We'll talk another time. Okay, see ya. Let's go see if the kids are hanging out. Amazing to think these things used to run. Kind of amazing they're still down here too. No way to get them out of here, I guess. This place sure was something a long time ago. Ooh. Because this mural is a, of a historical note, Molly. What do we know? Are we taking a tour down here? Well, sometime overnight, uh-oh, someone used bolt cutters on the gate and came down here. Oh, what'd they use a paint? Look, somebody trashed the mural. Looks to be. Says they intend to nuke Poss something. I think it's likely some kid saw one of the old Nuke Possum Springs tags from back when and got bored halfway through writing it. We need to treat this as a terrorist action. I'm sorry? This mural is of historical note. All right, well, I'll round up any uh, terrorists I see. Round up any dirtbag teens or vagrants that, that have been hanging around town. Check out by the abandoned food donkey. They come off the train there. Yeah, I'm guessing it's going to probably be locals. I'm already on it. Molly. Yeah. Find whoever did this. Okay. I want to see them hang. Wow, dude. Harsh. I think at most they'd get a fine and some jail time. This was of historical note. This is like the town council, these guys. Without this, I don't know if there's a reason to keep this place open. Yeah, Kathleen, we all know what you think. What? You think I wanted this? It's not like any of you had ideas for this place. Kathleen, we are not going to put a rest home down here. <laughs> it's just wasted space. And they're down here anyway at Trolleyside News every day. We're not putting our elderly in a hole. Yeah, Colleen. Because we're like next, next up. At least if we closed it, I wouldn't have to keep an eye on this place. Thank you, Molly. That's helpful. If you're all done, I've got things to do. Oh, look at the vandalism. I'm going to be back and finish with their convo, but I wanted to check the vandalism. This sure is a picture. All right, there they go. They had a couple more things to say. Oh, man. Ah! Hope it wasn't her. Holy shit! The dudes! Someone hacked up the dudes! Who did this? Why did they do it? New Possum Springs. Alright. We're going back the other way so we can go street side, street level. Man, bummer about the uh, mural. All right, granddad, pierogues, hot pretzels. That guy hates us because we stole from him when we were a kid. Let's see if anything's changed on the bulletin board. Still looking for Casey Hartley. I, th I think we found his arm. We haven't heard anything else about the arm, have we? Wow, construction's finally done. Oh. Stairs is open for business. Wonder what's going on up there. Well, we gonna find out. New place, you guys. Oh, it's church. Is uh, May gonna have a reckoning? Is 
seems kind of unlikely, doesn't it? Hello, pastor, whoever you are. Oh, maybe this is... Oh, this is her mom. Hey, hon. I forgot. Mom worked at church. Hey, Moom. Wow, it's been a while since I was in here. I know, sweetie. Nice to see you in the building, at least. Did you meet the new pastor? Nope. Oh, she's around somewhere. Might be outside. She likes to go on walks. Cool, cool. I might bump into her. <laughs> so, how's church working? Good. Answering the phone. Entering data of various sorts. I'm trying to get everything into one unified app thing. Yeah, right. <laughs> you know they make programs just for church administration? I didn't. Yeah, exactly. I was watching online tutorials for the one we just got. I just got distracted by true crime videos. <laughs> Mom, I do declare you are slacking off at work. God will forgive me. Hey, did you hear about the dudes? The dudes? The mural in the tunnel. What about it, sweetie? Someone messed it all up. Wrote Nuke Possum Springs on it. Or tried to. Oh no, that's terrible. It's historically valuable. Yes, it is. Oh, what a tragedy. What a world, Mom. What a world. What a world. All right, sweetie. I better work. Good talk, Mom. Good talk. All right, I guess that's as far as we can go. <laughs> it's like young Sheldon where the mom works at church, or she did until she got fired. All right, cool. Uh, no, I guess not, because it didn't give that little symbol to go in. We're going to see what we can do over this way. Oh, look at this statue. And here's the church. Uh, look, they have bingo at 7 p.m. on Tuesdays. <laughs> Here's this. Oh, that's a fence. I thought it was a cemetery. You're warm enough at night? Yeah, you know, I get by. I'm wondering if this is the pastor. Well, I'm working on something to help you out. Oh, don't go to any trouble. I'm all right. That's good. Gonna get cold soon. I can get you some blankets for now. Oh, he must be living living rough. For some reason, we have a lot of blankets. You were gonna make breakfast, but you're not anymore. Could you swing by and make me some breakfast? <laughs> uh, and we got blankets. Ha ha ha. Stars, hot dogs, stars, hot dogs. All right, whatever. <laughs> Joy is good. Hey, hey, you're Candy Borowski's daughter, right? Yep, who are you? I'm Kate, but you can call me Pastor K. It's Friday, it's Friday, Sunny, and you've got bad allergy stuff. That's a good enough reason have a mush brain that's like way more syllables you're new here right 16 months something like that oh new to me at least this over here is Bruce hey hey Bruce is new to our community do you live in the woods yep but not for long we're working on fixing that before winter gets here gonna take some doing but God's a doer and they're bigger than city council. Still think it's a lot. Oh, he still thinks it's a lot of trouble to go to. Listen, nobody said loving your neighbor would be easy. And you're our actual neighbor. It's always trickier, isn't it? Much easier to love someone far away. I appreciate that. We all need a little help sometimes, Bruce. No shame in hard times. Well, it was nice meeting you both. Come up and see me at church sometime. I will. I'll be up to visit my mom anyway. See you later, Bruce. Okay, nice to meet you, Mary. May. May Borowski. Bruce. Just Bruce. <laughs> I know. It kind of is, isn't it? Pastor. Pastor Kate. Pastor K. And I'm not sure what this other picture is. 
Can I go rummage through your things, Bruce? I always wanted to climb the water tower. But then that one kid died doing that. Whatever. I'll get to it. Probably see clear to the brittle from there. I wonder where we're going to come out. I thought we would have hit the edge. Oh, I guess right there. <laughs> All right, cool. We got to do some new stuff, meet some new people. So bingo, 7 p.m. Tuesday. Be there or be square. Okay, Sunny. Oh, can we go down? Could we go down this hill? No. All right, let's see what else. Fat Pocket Pond, we can't go in there. See what these guys are up to. You gonna run out and do this on your break? Shh, she must be interviewing for a new job. I think I'm going to tell Nancy I'm sick. I can puke on command. Ew, gross. Well, that's one way to do it. I got a chance. I've got a change of clothes in the car. In case you puke on your regular clothes? No, I just want to look good for the interview. Good idea. I mean, it's Ham Panther. It isn't an art gallery in Paris. <laughs> But I figure any leg up is good. I'm excited. So am I. I wonder why he's excited. <laughs> Man, I wish I was getting breakfast. I'm hungry. I need to drink all this coffee so I've got like 20 minutes. Yeah, she's always smoking and he's always drinking coffee. All right, see you guys later. Uh, Market House. Hey, oh, who are you? How's it going, dude? Got a job here. That's cool. Oh, nice. Actually, I'm lying. It sucks. Oh, geez. I had no idea there were so many kinds of hammers and wrenches and nails. My God, the nails. <laughs> hey, B. Sorry about last night. Yo. Sorry. Oh, look, I'm saying her words, her lines, even before she says them. I get woozy on cold medicine. Yeah, whatevs. So I don't really know what I expected to happen. Sorry for what I said. You know, I don't really remember much. So whatevs. Hooray for alcohol. New to town motto. Band practice later? Ha ha, yep. Well, it seems like they're friends now. I'm amazed it's still a thing. We were barely even abandoned in high school. Yeah, it's fun. Get to hang out with Angus. How did you even end up doing it? When Casey left town, Angus told me that Greg was really sad, so I volunteered to be the new drummer. Well, drummer, it's a laptop B. It sure is, May, it sure is. I'll see you later, I've got some work to do. All right, well, interesting that now May and B are friends after that night. I've never been to war. Not like the recruiter didn't try, though. Hard. Yeah, where is that Navy recruiter guy? All right, let's go down to the video store. Hey! Whoa, hey! We got, like, the same shirt, dude, but, like, opposites. Oh, wow, what do you know? What's your shirt from? From? Yeah, is it, like, a band or something? Nah, I made it in home act back in high school. I just like the symbol. It's a null symbol, right? I don't know. What's your shirt mean? Secret symbol of God's Wrestling League. Whoa, what's that? Backyard wrestling? Whoa! Where does it happen? All over the place. Backyards, you know? How did I not know about this? It's secret. Oh, it's Fight Club. Because illegal, I think. And people go to the hospital and stuff. That is awesome. This is awesome. It's awesome. 
Holy crap, I'm gonna look this up. See you there sometimes. Sometime. Backyard Fight Club. In Possum Springs. Hey, Angus. Hey, May. Hey, Angus, how's it going? You're like the third person I've seen today. I know, you've explained it, but I have zero clue how this place stays open. You'd be surprised. Band practice later? Gotta warm up my voice. You growl real good. Thanks, I'm a born growler. When I was a baby, I never cried. I just growled. Well, I think he's a bear, so... I think I cried non-stop until I was like nine. And then I cried all the time starting again at like 13. <laughs> you had a good three years of not crying in there. Yeah, they were really productive years. Ha ha. Hey <laughs> hey. Okay, I guess we're done in the video store. Poss Wait, what the? What? No! No, 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 no! Postables is closed! Oh no, Postables is gone! No more pizza delivery, no more Big Sal, no more special birthdays. This is the worst thing that's happened to this town since the flood that took out the mini golf ice cream place. Summer nights, eating ice cream, playing some putt-putt, all washed away. I'm so freaking depressed now. Dang, Postables. This is so small town, you guys. I know I said yesterday I lived in a small town most of my life. So yeah, this is bringing, bringing a lot of that back too. Uh, I can't remember what this store is. Oh, this is the other side of the tunnel. No wonder I couldn't remember what store it was. <laughs> All right, let's see what the bar guys are doing. The bar flies. How about them smelters? Kick some blue bear ass last night. Good game, good game. Gonna be a hell of a season, bud. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty true, right? True to life. Hey, Jeremy? Jeremy Wharton? No one calls me that. Germ, right? Germ warfare. Oh, dude, seriously, no. Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's an okay name. Oh, okay. You were like a year behind me, right? Two years. So you're fresh out, huh? I hang out with Greg sometimes. We ride bikes. I'm pretty good at it. Oh, okay. What? I saw a rabid possum the other day. Really? Where? It was crawling across the road. Had it been hit by a car? Nah, just rabid. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. Wow, it was like a poem. What? Okay. Alright, let's go talk to Greg at the Snack Falcon. Hey, Greg. Well, look who it is. Yep, alive for another day. How are you feeling? I was feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town, and I don't know, that helped. Fresh air, as fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So what's up? We're gonna head, are we gonna head out to band practice? Oh no, I gotta do this guitar thing again. Ugh. Look, germ warfare's here. Practice. Yes. I crashed my bike once and a broken spoke went through my leg. Jeez. It was kind of cool. Oh yeah, I can see that. All right, kids. I gotta head out soon. Where are you going? Family stuff. Oh, okay. Just for a night. Okay, we doing this? Yeah, let's do it. Wait, I don't know the song. Like, at all. And I barely remember how to play bass. You'll be fine. I completely will not be fine. Zero self-confidence, huh? No, I just don't know the song. You stupid jerks. 
All right, here we go, you guys. Weird Autumn. I'm with May. I don't know this song at all. <laughs> oh no, it's getting crazy! As you know, I do not like these kinds of things. <laughs> this is why. control whoops <laughs> uh yeah so that happened oh may that was uh Pretty bad is what it was. I literally do not know this song. Die Anywhere. R.I.P. my bris, bris bass bass playing. Weird Autumn. Inexcusable. <laughs> I wonder if I'd have done it well if this would have been different. You know, like, oh, great job with a song you don't know. <laughs> well, yeah. So we pretty much knew that was going to happen. Hey, hey, Duder. Angus, leaving for the night? Yeah, going to be bored. Or rather, I would be if I didn't have plans. Plans? Crimes. Ooh, crimes. Yep, up for some crimes? Hmm. I might be hanging out with B. Let me check first. Cool. Let me know. Oh, I thought I was going to check with B. Okay. You up for some crimes? Hmm. Uh, we'll say definitely. Ooh, ow. Ow. <laughs> crimes, baby. Okay, so evidently crimes was some sort of we we have to do some crimes. And they found him out in the back of the junkyard. That's upsetting. He'd been there for a while. This is depressing. Really? I just thought it was like super raw. No, I mean the abandoned food donkey. Yeah, I know, right? It was a shock. I think in second grade, we colored pictures for Thanksgiving, and they were like food donkey themed. And then they put them up on these windows. Ha! Huh? I remember that kind of stuff. I remember that. It was like a donkey dressed up as a turkey. Yeah, horrifying. But really, really horrible. What did they do with all the food? Donkey, donkey turkeys got them. <laughs> Donk turkeys, donk turks, dern keys. So what are we doing here? Crimes. Um, okay, I'm like double in now. I've been living too clean, May. Damn right. We run this town. Why don't we go in? Hey! What the hell are you doing? I think I, yeah, cool, I got his attention. What? Oh, yeah, here he comes. Who? You don't know him, I don't think. Try me. 
Oh god, what is that smell? Glue. Uh oh. Oh no, is that. Sup, ladies? Ugh. Effin Steve Scriggins. Did you just actually make a fart noise? Ha ha ha. You ladies lost or something? Deal's a deal, Steve. I ain't forgot. Where is it then? In the back. I remember you, you know. I bet everyone remembers you. What are you doing in here? Your mom. Great, Steve. Yeah, it's hilarious. All the ways. Cool. I'm your new dad. Steve, you sincerely could not get with my mom. Is that a challenge? Okay, well, uh, can we get on with this thing? I guess we're just waiting. Oh, a hot dog. Hot dogs. What? What's happening with the hot dogs? So, this still works sometimes? Uh, you know Beth Holstead? Yeah. She was in here like six months ago, and she swears it talked. Whoa. Didn't even have to push the button. But I don't know how much steak I'd put in it. You know Beth. Kinda? There's a lot of glue in here. I guess. God damn it! What? Someone locked the effing door! God damn it! I bet it was Beth! Or Levy. Or the train trash. So... Ah! Well, they better not have stolen anything. Hey, Maruski, welcome back. We're in the uh, shutdown food donkey. From the abandoned grocery store with the unlocked doors. What's behind this door anyway? Could probably bust it open. Or I could go get my lockpick stuff. I bet there's like a key or something. I mean, I knew you would want me to catch you up, right? <laughs> Whatever. Okay, we can't go that way. Whoa! I wonder where Greg's lockpick stuff is. What are you doing? Trying to find something to help bust down the door. Cool, I'm looking for a key because I'm smarter. Uh-huh, but I get to hit things. Crap. How much glue did they need in here? Dude, you gotta stick stuff. You gotta stick stuff to stuff to run a successful business. Well, apparently not. What are you doing? Gonna check that office up there. Cool. Don't like slice yourself to death on glass. Dumb death. Dumb death. Hey, Sonny. Breakfast ready? I'll be right over. <laughs> okay, we can't get up to the office. How do we get up there? Maybe we gotta jump up on these. Uh, yeah, I'm guessing it's something to do with this. Ugh, it's funny they list this game as a platformer, but like we do such tiny bit of platforming that I actually forget we sometimes have to do it. Hmm, I'm not jumping up there. What's happening? Oh, he's still here at the door. Okay. Doesn't seem like uh, that that sh that um, where the office is up there is on the same plane as this. So maybe we can't jump up there. Although, I think that was the point. See, it seems like she's in front of it. Huh. I wonder if I'm missing something. Whoops.
What's up at the top? Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. No wonder this place went under. People leaving keys all over the place. Don't mind if I do. I found some keys. Let's see. I'm the key master. <laughs> I will unlock your ass. Yeah, I heard that about you. Oh, oh ouch. <laughs> Dude, just give it up, man. You idiot, stop kicking before you break your femurs or something. I'm not an idiot. Yeah, sorry. Hey, idiot and Greg, stop kicking. I got keys. Where'd you get them? Office up there. No wonder this place went under, leaving keys all over the place. That was exactly what I thought. I'm upset that we thought, like, the exact same words. I thought it better. Why are we doing crimes with this guy? Robbers can't be choosers. They really can. You know I can hear you, right? <laughs> ah! Oh god, these guys. I was both terrified and super into these things. When they put them out front, they moved. They look so tiny when they're in pieces. We're smaller in pieces, too. Too real. I hope you get chopped up by a chopper. Well, I hope you get chopped up by a blunt chopper. You two are weird. Okay, we're stealing one of these. Is it even stealing? It's better if we think of it as stealing. Cool. Ah! 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 Dude, what? Ah! Dude, what? Stop screaming. I can't pick. They all look great. You get one. That's the deal. Hurry up. Ooh, let me pick. Let me pick. Sure. Uh, which one do we want? Do we want donkey? Or pig? Or frog? We should have a quick poll. <laughs> what should we pick, you guys? Donkey? Pig or frog? Anyone? 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 Frog. All right. Sunny gets it. She answered first. Ooh, greeny here. I used to have dreams about this thing. Sex dreams? Dude, you. Probably. Best you could get. Probably. Do frogs even have sex? Nah, they got like eggs or something. You two are really, really dumb. Steve, seriously? You're saying that to me? Okay, so how do we get it? No, we want this one. Oh, maybe we have to look at each of them and talk about them. Pretty cool pig. Yeah, pretty all right. Didn't he used to, like, hold, like, sausage links or something? Yeah, that's messed up. Yeah, it is kind of messed up. Eating his own kind, or her own kind. Whatever, PC police. PC yourself into traffic, Steve. Anyway, cannibal pig man? Cannibal pig. Jeez, why does she get to pick? Why is this such a thing? This is taking forever. Scriggins, bite my entire ass. What? Go legally brain dead from lack of oxygen due to choking on my entire ass. Uh, what? Classic. That's right, Steve. Classic. Oh my god, can we just get this done already? Oh, I remember these being less horrifying. They were tall then. You couldn't see their faces. I gotta look at you ladies' faces. <laughs> I think this one's kind of cute. Oh, he thinks it's cute. Steve, you are a disease. Ugh, which one? I'm bad at decisions that actually mean something. You picked out the tuxes we wore to junior prom. Oh yeah, I'm pretty good at it. Remember how Tim Whiteley rode that giant tractor into homecoming? Totally. 
So, did you pick? Dude, uh, I totally did. Oh, cool. Okay, kids, we're gonna go with... Actually, I'm not sure yet. <laughs> Froghead! Oh, yeah, froggy robot. Finally. Damn. Shut up, Steve. You know what? I ain't carrying nothing. See you, ladies. Steve! Get found dead, punks. Hehe. <laughs> All right. Hey, he says punks like it's a bad thing. I don't care. He's scum and a criminal, and anyway, I think he's been bad news from the start. Yes. What deal did you make with him? He's allowed to shoplift whatever he wants from the Snack Falcon. Wow. While I'm working. Well, that'll get you fired. See, see, criminal all the way. Some people... So should we smash a window to get this out of here? Oh god, I still smell the glue. My neighbors are going to think I'm on drugs or just like gluing the hell out of something. Oh, okay, so we're really carrying this thing up the stairs? This is going to be great. You are so going to die. Ha ha ha. You're going to get squashed like a pancake. Ha ha ha. But seriously, don't kill me. Watch me, and I'll give you the signals. Roger, roger. Ah! <laughs> Sorry about that. That was kind of awesome. Well, I'm glad you didn't get killed. I would totally haunt this entire stairwell. Ready to go? Yep. <laughs> you said go that way dude oh I'm sorry it's cool I think I sprained something oh crap let's go see I think I was supposed to be on the landing oh come on this is hard I think we should have been on the landing when when he said stop but we weren't there yet jeez you know, this is a really stupid idea. It wouldn't be if we just worked together. I'm trying. I am trying. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We need to rethink our strategy. Okay, shoot. How about this time you don't almost kill me? Oh, good. Okay, because before I forgot to not kill you, Duly noted, before I forgot to not kill you. I'm never getting this frog head up the stairs. My entire life has passed before my eyes in this stairwell. That's like metaphorical. I just want to get this thing upstairs. Why has God forsaken me? Okay, let's go. I'm really getting tired. Yeah, me too. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I did it! Oh, I was too slow. We almost made it to the landing that time. <laughs> Oh, man, don't give up hope. I mean, we could just quit, but, like, don't give up hope. Ah! Let's go. I'm anticipating what's happening. Screw it. We're taking the elevator. Oh, there's an elevator? Yeah. Maybe you can't do it. But this way puts us out closer to our door. I will never forgive you for this. What? All right. So maybe there was no way to complete that successfully. I'm going to have to look up how to fix this. Angus isn't back till tomorrow night. I'll think about it later. Want to get some food? Look, see, there's the frog back there. Uh, hell Yeah. Too bad you didn't snap your spine. Too bad your arms didn't get ripped off. Too bad you weren't horribly disfigured. Too bad you didn't fall and break your teeth on a stair. 
Too bad you didn't get trapped under the box. Too not finished. And then burned alive in a building fire. Too bad you didn't crawl into a vent to escape the fire and get cooked. Ah, good times. I know, right? They're like harsh. I still smell glue. Think about something else. I can't. I think I'm high from the glue. Think about pierogies. They have pierogi. Did they have pierogies when you were at school? This one church in town would sell them during whatever holiday. Feast of the Perpetual Pierogi. Yo, dude. What? Open your mouth. Why? Trust me. True friendship is this. All right, just stay like that. Okay. Boom, got in one. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I think we're throwing tacos. I was thinking they were pierogies. Maybe they are pierogies. They look like tacos. Oh, pierogi waster. Man, I got the first one right and I got cocky. I was like, oh, this is easy. Ugh. <laughs> okay, this is a hilarious mini game, can I just say? Boom. Oh, come on. That went in. Oh, my face. <laughs> Got a green one for different color splashes. Oh, <laughs> oh it burns. Oh man. They, they must the first one must have been a gimme so that you could you could uh feel confident. Oh. <laughs> Out of pierogies. Dang. You know, a majority of those attempts hit me directly in the face. Sorry about that. <laughs> I think I might be sick. True friendship. Letting your friend make you sick. True bros. True bros. I feel like this is the first time we've just gotten to hang out. How's it feel? I mean, I'm very sore and I smell like glue. Yeah, I'm going to take an hour-long shower when I get home. So how have things been? Uh, good. Weird seeing you with a regular job that you like. That Oh, that you like go to. Yeah, working on the plan. The plan? Bright Harbor. Bright Harbor? Yeah, we're going to move to Bright Harbor. Since when? A uh, year or so now? That's why we're working like seven days a week. But when are you moving? I think in the spring. That's like a few months away. Yeah. Oh. You should come visit when we get settled in. Why Bright Harbor? Oh, May, it's so cool. We visited in the summer. There's like record stores and weird bars and everyone's cool and like free oh that's where i got my tattoo what yeah um i guess it's a sheep is that a sheep yep why a sheep the tattoo guy was like all the way hot and it didn't even hurt you have a tattoo you're moving to bright harbor yeah, things change. Yeah, poor May. Oh, what's wrong? Nothing. How long do you think you're staying in town? Um, I don't know. I'll help you pick somewhere out. Yeah. It was really great hanging out with you tonight. I've been I've been really boring lately. Haven't done a crime in a long time. Why? Angus, the plan. Can't go to Bright Harbor if I get caught or fired. You're all adult now. I'm bona fide. 
I'm going to go, I think. Good call. We need to de-glue. I think we stunk up the diner. Eh, wouldn't be the first time. I missed you. You too, bro. So I wonder at the end if May's going to go back to college. She's clearly having some crimes. <laughs> Let's go talk to Dad. Sup, Dad. Heard you had a wild time last night. I didn't drink. It works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> wow, hold on. Let me write that down. It's complicated, I know. What did you do tonight? Um, help Greg move some stuff. Look at what a good friend you are. Helping someone move is quite a gesture. Well, we've been best friends since, like, forever. So I feel like we're well past that point. I'm really, really sore, though. Sometimes you got to get sore for friends. Hey, Dad, would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? I've been an excellent daughter. That doesn't count. Well, would you watch some TV with me? Yeah, for a little bit. Hop up. I'm watching Garbo and Malloy. Nice. <laughs> Garbo and Malloy. Welcome back, folks. Hell of a show tonight. Say, Malloy. Yes, Garbo? Ever get the feeling that disaster's right around the corner? Sure do, right before we start the show every night. <clears throat> You're super, you superstitious, Garbo? Not anymore. What happened? I've broken every mirror I've ever owned, and now I'm lucky enough to never have to look at this mug. Ha ha ha. Yeah, but what about the rest of us? What? That's a wappa. Coming up next, Garbo and I join a cult. All right, well, cool watching TV with you, Dad. At least I know now I don't have to go in the storeroom until he moves the boxes. I don't have to go in there every time I come up here. All right, let's see if we got any uh, mail. Nope. We could play some guitar, but I don't think we're going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do that any more than I have to. Mm. We're having another dream. This time we don't have a bat. Ooh. Freaky. Hmm. Looks like I can jump um, up to that top where that lantern is. Bah! Nope, I guess not. Well, I don't know where I'm supposed to jump there, so we'll probably have to, if we have to do that, then I suspect we'll be back. Oh, look, there's some birds up here. Maybe we're just turning all the lights on. Oh, we're on the power lines. That sky and moon's a little no man's sky looking, I gotta say. Whoops, no, I want to go up. Always, always up. Make the birds fly away. I'm dreaming about climbing the power lines. Woohoo!
Well, I kind of want to jump up there, but I'm kind of afraid if I do, I will have to start over. Oh, no, that worked. Can't actually see where I'm going, so that's a problem. Oh, there we go. Look, it's a dude playing the sax. Jamming, buddy. You wouldn't think his mouth was best formed to play the sax, but I guess it's okay. All right, let's see if we can land on the power lines from here. Woohoo, baby! Now at least we got some jams going. Let's go up the other side. Boop! I like this. It gives me a little break from reading all those uh, speech bubbles. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Shoot! Alright, I gotta get back on the power line. <laughs> Just groove into the tunes, man. Groove into the tunes. I turned the brightness on my TV back down this morning because I'd still had it high up from Machinarium. Now I'm kind of wishing I'd left it. Oh. I'm guessing there's going to be somebody playing another instrument up on the other window. Up on this side. Let's see if we can get up on the top of this. I can't actually see it, so... Oh, right, there we go. Bop! Yay! Oh, euphonium. Or tuba, I'm not sure which. Looks like a euphonium to me. Woo! Groovy! This is a good dream. Oh, look at that! Oh, we're jamming now, man. Okay, is this where we already were? I think it is. This is where the lines are, isn't it? Yeah, okay, we're gonna keep going this way. School! Oh, we're stuck. I guess we must have missed somebody back at the beginning. Before we knew what we were supposed to be doing. Maybe it was that one place I couldn't jump up on. Hey, Kim! Ha! Uh, I'll tell you an interesting thing. The reason I know Euphonium, and good morning, is uh, my one of my nieces, the husband of my niece, not only plays the Euphonium in the uh, army band, but he, uh, playing behind, he's one of those players. Or at Arlington Cemetery at uh, funerals, again, they have a band. He's, he's in that band. Super niche. Oh man, how can I not get up on this one? There's got to be something else. I think this is what we're, what I'm missing is this one. Oh look, I'm on this part now. Can I get up on this? Yes. All right. Oh, there's another wire up there. Yeah, that's right. Use the euphonium in the marching band. Everyone thinks they're tubas, but they're euphonium. Oh, look at that. We got an accordion player. All right, that's the end that way. All right, so we're missing somebody. 
I, I mean, I'm assuming we'll wake up when we get all the band, the band going. This one's awesome. I like this dream. I like it better than the smashing things up dream. I wonder what's going to be next. What other instrument we're going to get. Oh, yay. I'm glad I didn't fall off. Oh, the sa Oh, yeah. We had sax guy. He was the first guy. Okay. All right, well, it's a little repetitive, but still cool. Ooh, what's over here? Have we been over here? I don't know. Oh, no! Oh, no! Jump too soon. I mean, I don't know. I'm assuming this is probably the first wires, but I'm not positive, so I want to go again. can't actually see it. It's part of the problem. It's really dark. All right, let's see. On my screen, super dark. to jump on that on the, uh, the the pole first and I can't really see where the pole is so I was trying to jump over but that doesn't work I mean I know it's right in front of me but I can't really see it okay there it is there oh that's euphonium guy well I wonder if that's is that not the whole band I don't know what, what I missed. I mean, we've got side to side here. Something I missed. What else would they have? Maybe drums? Oh look, now we got all four of those lights are going. Cool. That was a cool one. Uh-oh. It was a cool one. Yikes. Ah. Turned into a nightmare. Wake up, May. Wake up. Dang, that was that was cool until it wasn't, huh? Oh, we got some messages. Hey, I'm working today if you want to say hello. Yep, that's my life right here. That's from B. Let's see what Greg says. Morning. I'm somehow even more sore. This is bullshit. I'm working today. Angus is out of town and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. Sincerely, Gregory. <laughs> he writes funny uh, emails. Very formal. All right. Let's get to getting on here. See what's going on in the town. Let's see if Dad cleaned out the storeroom yet. Nope. Yeah, Dad. All right, just checking. Maybe tomorrow. God, this thing is intense. Weird how big clocks are. Luxury furniture now. Since everything has a clock and internet on it, like having something big that only does one thing is like 
a statement or something. Okay. Let's go talk to mom. Good morning. Did you feel it last night? Did I feel it? No. But you know what I'm talking about, right? Spill it, Mom. There was a big sinkhole two streets over. Oh, are we still getting those? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground and so forth. And on a floodplain. Oh, weird. I don't want you over there nosing around it. I guarantee you I won't. I have seen sinkholes. No interest at all? Mom, they're just holes in the ground. Get back to me when one like swallows a house or something. We'll go see together if that happens. Deal. So what did you do last night? Hung out with Greg. What did you do? Uh, I know, right? Exactly. Why did she tell her about it? Uh, I went to the grocery store. That sounds exciting. Get anything special? Oh boy, sure did. Well, stop by the church if you're in the area. Will do, Mom. See ya. Mm, bye, sweetie. All right. Let's go see what trouble we can get into today. We're not going to see Mr. Prescott again. Or Pendercast, or whatever his name was that was over there. Hey, Smelters. Hey, Borowski. Oh, Selmers. <laughs> smelters are the team that the barb flies talk about. Now, we all know how important it is to look our best. What? Our appearance is the first and sometimes last impression we make. Selmers, did you join a cult? Lucky for you, I happen to be a licensed dealer. Oh, uh, okay. Of the Sylvam family of products. Selmers, I don't have any money. Oh, okay. Have you sold anything yet? Sold some to my mom. And to Abby Krangler. Mrs. Krangler's daughter? Granddaughter. I run into her at the laundromat over by the school. One time, Greg got locked inside one of the tumble dryers. Did he die? Uh... He wanted me to start it, but I chickened out. Yeah, good thing. He definitely would have died. Tell him that. He's still mad. Want to hear a poem? Oh, you bet, man. Sure. Sometimes I think and start to sink. Oh, no. There's more. Sorry. Then I remember it's October. October? I combine my two favorite months. Fall is really nice. It's the best. Days are going to start getting shorter soon. It makes me sad. I like it. I love the fall, but I hate the dark. I like it. You sure do. I seen a raccoon. Where? Up in Towny Center Sentry. He's a big un. Cool. All right, let's go harass this dude up on his porch. My cat doesn't like folks on the porch. Look, I had noticed his jack-o'-lanterns before. That's pretty cool. Can we get in here yet? Nope. Everybody's got their little pumpkins out. Maybe I didn't notice them before because they're new. All right, let's see what's going on down in the hole. No tunnel fishermen. We don't have this guy, so we probably got the teenagers hanging out. Oh, they cleaned the mural, it looks like. No, they didn't. Too bad. Yeah, the hangout kids. Rainy day, huh? But not down here. You kids have your own little secret hideout down here, huh? <sighs> Whatever. When I was a kid, literally nobody cares. Dang. Well, whatever. Okay, then. I like to run all the way over JIC, but... We'll go back upstairs. I 
And I like that music dream until it started getting dark. Until a bear came. <laughs> All right, let's go check the church. See what Pastor K and Mom are up to. And Bruce. Now we got some new people to talk to. Hey, Mom. Hey, sweetie. I completely forgot where the sanctuary is. Uh, you passed the door on your way here. Oh, I thought those were locked. They're locked sometimes. All doors are locked sometimes. Not like saloon doors. Cowboys just walking in and out. That's very rude. The Old West was a very rude time. <laughs> That's fairly random. Howdy, partner. I say, I say, this is powerful rude. That's like a southern gentleman. He's classing up the place. Our nation. Okay, Mom. No, bo no more cowboy talk for you. Dag, gum it. I gotta get back to work, sweetie. Love you. Anybody in here? Nope. Let's see if we can get in the sanctuary now. Assuming that's gonna be one of these doors. That's why I had to go up that little step. Oh, let's see what's going on in here. Here's Pastor K. I suppose she's going to reform us. Hey again. Hey, your mom will be pretty happy you're here. Oh, I don't know it. You're not a churchgoer? Oh, don't I know it. Sorry. <laughs> no. Big fan of sleeping in? I mean, aren't you? I can't remember the last time I slept in. Might have been last Saturday. That's not long ago. It's been a very long week. Same, honestly. When did you stop coming? When my mom stopped making me? When I was like 15 or so? Why? I don't know. All the sitting and standing. Sing this now, feel this now. Well, the feelings are more suggestions. Doesn't feel like it. Well, I hope maybe... I hope you'll maybe come some Sunday. Yeah, I guess I haven't seen you preach. Oh, wow, preach. Kind of has a bad ring to it, huh? Talk? That works. Hey, how are things with the whole Bruce situation? Well, we're praying and gears are turning, but they turn slow. But God can turn any gear they want, and I take comfort in that. I hope it turns out okay. Thank you. Ooh, you know, you're not supposed to be up there, May. But we'll let it slide this time. All right, that takes care of church. See what these, this, let's see if she got the job. Oh, she's not talking. Pre pregnant raccoon doesn't talk to us either. All right, here's Bee's place. Hey, Bee. Hey, May. How's it going? Got a load of rock salt to move. Came in early this year and like a crap load of snow shovels. Usually the distro place doesn't goof up like this. Maybe it's run by weather wizards? Yeah, that's not a bad theory. So what's up? Wanna hang out tonight? Uh, I'm working. If you wanna like, come along. Uh, I was thinking we'd go play putt-putt out in Hunwick. May, that's actually not a bad idea, but sorry, got work. Aw, oh, geez, what is even the point? Paychecks, rent, food, medicine, that kind of thing. So, do you want to come along or not? House call. Oh, I wasn't expecting that to happen. I guess we're going out with B to what? Couldn't you just ref oh to make a house call? <laughs> Do you think the hardware store delivers? Not my hardware store in any town I ever lived in. 
Well, I guess that's not true. Our hardware store delivered if you bought something like a washing machine. Couldn't you just, like, refuse to do house calls? Nope. Why? It's called a job. People pay you to do it. Ideally, at least. You coming? There's a big thing back here by the driveway. Yeah, she's an old lady. She's got weird shit in her yard. It's like a windmill. Yep. I've never been back up here before. Hey, Borowski, you have now been here. It's nice. Ooh, a new house, a new person to meet. Yeah, just a bunch of old cabins people turned into houses. Some hunting camps. So, like, don't get shot or anything. Buck season isn't for a few days, right? Well, folks get impatient for murder. It ain't murder if it's animals. That's dark. Hold that thought. You gonna knock? Thank you for coming out on such short notice. No problem. I can sleep through a four alarm fire, but that furnace... We'll take a look at it. Ever since Jean passed, I just can't abide that thumping. Understandable. Jean was such a darling man. Hey, what did you mean by hold that thought? Wait for it. I'll never forgive them for taking him away. Uh-huh. Ain't like I didn't treat him right. I looked it up on the internet. He didn't smell or nothing. Wait for it. You can't take a woman's husband just because he's dead. Oh my goodness. There it is. Holy God. Took him right off that couch. It's a crime. Yeah, a crime was definitely committed, all right. They just couldn't abide him not being able not being able to tax any, him anymore. That's what it was. Lady, ew. Well, I won't talk your ears off about it. Come on, take a look at my fridge while you're here. Yeah, we bill by the half hour. Yikes, man. Good job. Yeah, it's a nice fridge. What's the problem? Oh, there's no problem. It's just a classic. An original Luna Freeze. Wow. They were all the rage when I was your age. They last forever. They make me feel so young. I saw one of these the other night when I got back into town. Oh, really? Where? Upside down under some logs in a creek in a ravine. So, furnace? Oh, yes, right through here to the basement. Sounds good. Come on, May. All right, we'll be down there for a bit. Please remember not to lock us in. What? Last time we sent someone, he got locked in the basement. I assure you that did not happen. Um, he called me from your basement. Your man did smell a bit of booze when he came by. Um, okay. Busted. Or something. Okay, down we go. It was nice meeting you. I don't really know who you are, little person. <laughs> oh, she's got some cool stuff down here. Oh man, I love creepy basements. And why wouldn't you? Look at all this splendor. Gee, she's got a lot of junk. Maybe she's got a few more husbands stacked in the corner. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, let's get this done so we can go home. Oh man, we want to play with some stuff. Uh, isn't it illegal to smoke indoors? It is. Well, 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 be the criminal. It's a dummy. I'm trying to quit. So I chew on this thing. What? Notice no smoke coming out? No smoke at all? But like, I've seen you smoke. Yeah, not indoors. I totally thought it was real. Where'd you think the smoke was going? I thought you were swallowing it? May, do you know how smoking works? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not a smoking scientist, Beatrice. Good Lord, what else don't you know? Sorry, I didn't get a degree in cigarettology. What even was your major in college? Kicking ass and getting rad. Yeah, May, eh. So that's a furnace? Yes, that's the furnace. 
I've decided his name is Clanky. Okay. You just hang out. I'm going to go fix this right quick. Don't, like, break anything. Oh, cool. So I can play while she does that. What am I going to break? This is a basement full of crap. Do, 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 do. Oh, geez. Okay. Shouldn't be long. Can I help? Nope. Why am I here then? Because you wanted to come along. Just chill, man. Ooh, this is an old ass fan. It's made of metal and you could chop your finger off. Yeah, I remember these fans. And you could chop your finger off. Oh, fishing pole, fishing pole. Whoops. Fish, fish, fish! Ah, my old nemesis, Professor Lucius von Nomeo. Okay, you guys, I have to tell you this funny story. Maruski already knows about this. So there's this guy who streams uh, webcam on his patio on Twitch. It's called, uh, he's called Dave's Nut Hut, I think. Dave's Nut House. No, Dave's Nut Hut. Maruski, if you're on here, give him a shout out so they can go see if they want to. Anyway, uh, so it's a bunch of like bird feeders and waterers and stuff like that. And you can just go, when you log in, you can just watch his birds hop around and chill and chat. So anyway, another guy on, I guess on Twitch who lives nearby and knows him, snuck in at night and glued these little gnomes all over the, all over the bird feeders and the bird bath. And he had like two sitting in the bird bath. So funny. So the next morning you go in and log on and you see all these gnomes everywhere. And then somebody posted the clip cause it's his webcams on 24 hours. Somebody clipped where the guy snuck in and glued all the gnomes. And so you could watch it. It was in the chat. So you could watch the video and see him come in and glue the gnomes everywhere. It's pretty funny. <laughs> All right, I'm going to give him a shout out. I think Maruski's wandered off. She might be over at Dave's. Let's see, Dave's Nut Hut, all oh, one word. It's a very chill stream, obviously, because, you know, it's a, it's a, uh, it's a uh, webcam, basically. Let's see if you can do it with, when, it, when it's someone not in the stream. Nut, is it Nut House or Nut Hut? Nut Hut. Okay, so if you don't follow Dave's Nut Hut, you should just have it in your library of Twitch streams that you do, uh, because it's really chill and sometimes you see cool stuff and it's funny and you know, pretty, pretty, pretty mild. All right, I want this bat. Why are you not letting me play with the bat? I don't know. I can't get the bat. I wonder if it's. I wonder if I have to get the bat in order to. Oh, look, here's a tennis racket. Woohoo! Hey, badminton! 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 Racket! Hmm, badminton. Okay, I already did all these. <laughs> I bet I can make something out of all this junk. Jeez. Who even would have this much junk? Well, a lot of people. Okay, this I could see being useful. And a fan. I could see this being useful in furnace fixing. This looks useful. This looks useful. Uh, I need your expertise to fix this stupid furnace, Professor. All right, and then the bat. We didn't get to mess with the bat. What the heck? Okay, now what? All right, so I can't carry anything else. So I'm going to say this is enough stuff. So got a gnome, a fishing pole, a badminton racket, and a fan. Got two wheels and a turny thing with no wheel. Probably just need to turn the turny thing. Uh-oh, I think B is going to be mad at her for this. To open up the heat pipes. Clanky's probably got loads of heat, but it can't get out. To get the Clanky all, to get Clanky all hot and bothered, we will teach Clanky to love. I bet I could, hmm. 
I think Nomi could bite onto the turny thing where the wheel was. Could use racket as a handle. Yeah, that would work. Although we're not always going to be here to pull it. One good hard pull should do it. Okay, focus. Work this out, Mayborowski. I wonder what it's like. <laughs> I'm hungry. Could go for some of that wolf. That donut wolf. There's that video online of their slammer cake machine. Watching it was how I fell asleep like half the nights at school. Big, complicated machine making delicious cakeums. I can't imagine how anyone built something like that. Everything works perfectly, but it's so weird looking. Like someone was just making it up as they went along and somehow created perfection. Maybe I should just wing this. Well, maybe I should just wing this too. Wing this too. Just do it fast so I don't overthink it. Okay, let's do it. Tie the racket to the turny thing and then tie that to the fan. But wait, how am I going to keep the fan from rolling up like a big fan fish? Okay, sorry, Nomi. I have to put you upside down like a vampire. I think they used to bury vampires upside down. So when they tried to dig out of their coffin, they just dig down because haha, -ha, stupid vampire. Now you're in the center of the earth and you died again. Check out this Rube Goldberg machine. Oh, hey, this looks great. I'm like an engineer or whoever makes machines. A machine engineer? All right, let's give this baby a go. Okay, done. What? I think I fixed it now. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, we did. We? What did you do? I engineered an elegant long-term solution. <laughs> God damn it. Way to go, May. Please don't fix anything ever again. Like, don't even have a pet. Anything you have to maintain. Aw, oh, friggin' crap. It was totally gonna work. This is so typical. I'm gonna check the exit. I'm gonna see if they're, uh, if she locked the door. Wait here. Oh, that's what we're gonna use the bat for. Damn it. I hope they brought their cell phone. Well, we're locked in. Ah, I knew this was gonna happen. Stupid, stupid bee. We can cut a hole in the floor. With what? Maybe she has an old saw down here. And we're gonna what? Build a heap of garbage to stand on and saw a circle in the floor? Like a cartoon? Well, now with that attitude. Well, this knob is really old and loose. Maybe I can, like, figure this out. I'll look around, too. Yeah, you go look around a whole bunch. Dude, we are totally getting the bat now. Oh, it won't let us have the bat. Hmm. The one thing she could hear is her furnace when it was broken. Broken things need to be broken. I don't think B's going to like this if we break the furnace again. Hmm. Didn't let us do that anyway. <laughs> oh, we're going to take the bat and break the furnace. Now we get to use the bat. Well, it's the one tool I do know how to use. A tool for beating ass! This is such a bad idea, May. Is there any way I can stop you from doing this? Surely she can hear that clanking. Why doesn't B tell her to stop? I guess we're just breaking the furnace. Ha 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 ha! Suck it, you piece of crap furnace! Wow, that is pretty loud! Yeah, geez. Surprised I can't hear that back in town. Okay, cool, she's coming, thank God. Thank me, more like? Hey, Mrs. Miranda, you locked us in. Well, that was fun. Uh-huh. You all right? She gave us lemonade. Yeah. It's such a nice night out. Lovely. Then what's up? Nothing. Just tired. Worked all day. I'm all hyper. Good for you. 
Ugh, you're zero fun. Yep. You need, like, some magical shit to, like, give you a new perspective. Let me know when that happens. Wouldn't want to miss it. All right. Man, you're boring. All right, let's go cruise around in the woods because we're all hyper. Ooh, the windmill, the windmill. Can we get the windmill going? Look at the little starry things floating around. Surely some oops, surely something's gonna happen with the little starry things. Something magical, I'm assuming. Okay. Now we got all the little starry things gathered up. Now what's gonna happen? Starry things. Okay, we can't go any further that way. We'll go back to um, B with the starry things, the sparkly things. See if that helps. Gather us up. I wonder if they're lightning bugs. Hmm, guess that didn't work. Some, maybe some, look, we left her with this. Look, they stayed over there. <laughs> Let's go back to the windmill. That seemed like to be the only thing we could interact with. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. What do we think? I don't think I've used, or maybe I've used one cheat. Or maybe I haven't used any cheats in this game, actually. Might have to do one here, because man, I don't know what's supposed to happen. I thought we'd get the windmill turning. And the, uh, the gathering up the fireflies seemed pretty magical. And that's what happened when we were on the windmill. So let's go back over here and see what's going on with that. Oh, more fireflies. Look, there's another one we gathered up. Oh, he didn't stay with us. Oh, yes, he did. There's another one. Wow! Ha 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 ha! Are you like a firefly whisperer or something? They just like me, I guess. That's... You're an interesting person, May Broski. Granddad said, Being interesting is all you can hope to be. Well, mission accomplished. Woohoo! You know... I have to say, this would have been a much less exciting evening if you weren't along for the ride. See, I'm good to have around. I mean, you can certainly beat the shit out of a furnace. I can beat the shit out of anything. You should, like, channel that aggression you always have into something useful. Er, Dr. Hank said way back I needed to repress it. Repress? Not, like, learn to deal with it? He specifically said repress. Um, okay, hmm. So, do you think Miss Miranda, like, pulled her husband's guts out? Isn't that what you do for mummies? I don't know, May. Do you think you'd have the stomach for it? Nope. It probably took a lot of heart. Ha ha. Yep. I wish she would explain it to us. Ha 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 ha. I get it, May. She really wrecked him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that probably stayed in place. Yeah, that should that should stay where it belongs. I'm leaving. Hey, you got to live your life. Bye. This is me gone. Hey, wait up. You're walking back to town. You've got a lot of gall to say that. I'm calling the cops. 
<laughs> Alright, that was funny. Gotta admit it. Alright, now what's happening? Back home. Here's your journal. I know, some super good dad jokes. Hey, Daco, how's it going? How are you, man? I was watching you play last night, and I was thinking all that building, not the fighting part, but the building and the mining and all that, was uh, s not dissimilar to what I'm doing in No Man's Sky. <laughs> An interesting parallel. Oh, man, I'm sorry you're tired. It's Friday, right? Thank you, Sunny, for giving Daco a shout out. How's work? You know, better than the glass factory. Is it? I mind, I've ran machines, but now I get to slice steaks and hawk salamis. I mean, it's easier on the back, that's for sure. But like, do you like it? I like having a paycheck. Fair. Paychecks, the sweetest meats of all. True. What'd you do tonight? Oh, uh, you know, stuff. Tired. Feel like I just did a day's work. <laughs> hey, you should, Daco. You should. You totally should. I'm really all about it these days. <laughs> you know, there are places you can get paid for work these days. Oh, really? I'll be interested if you stream it. I'll be interested to see your see your stuff. Yeah, they call it working. Ha, huh, you kids with your slang. Slang you could pick up at work. Yeah, yeah, point made. Um, what about those boxes I asked about in the crawl space? Hmm, I'm thinking about it. Watch some TV with me? Yeah, for a little bit. Perfect timing. Garbo and Malloy is starting. Oh, yeah. Let's remind... What is that? What was that, um... TV show on South Park that they watch. Now I can't remember. Ah, uh, yes. Everybody's shouting you out, Daco. Because <laughs> you're awesome. Uh, you know, Daco streams different things almost every day. I could not think about it at all. I was thinking about it this morning and th wondering how you did that. Uh, like, I have a hard enough time streaming two different games a day, but I stream them every day until I'm done. Uh, and I don't know how you can do it, a different game every day. You know, we like to get political here. Gotta do it. Gotta. You hear about this new law in the books? Pirating a movie online? You know about that? I do. Punishable by up to 10 years in prison. Wow, and here I've been trying to get in the hard way. Ha <laughs> ha. He has, folks. Wonder if pirating a movie about first-degree murder earns you more prison respect than one about grand larceny. Hey, Malloy, you know what I think about that law? What, Garbo? That's a wappa. Ha, 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 ha. I mean, but still, like, I, on, so Saturday morning when I play my indie game, because I have Sunday all day and Monday morning off. That means after Saturday morning, I don't play that game again until Tuesday. And when I come back in on Tuesday, I'm like, how does this game work? What's going on? So in your rotation, you only play each game like once a week. Ah, uh, man, I would be totally, I wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> Coming up next, stupid sandwiches. I'd just be like, how do I work the controls? What's happening? What game is this? All right, mom's not here because, you know, it's night. So let's go up to our room. Be the end of another day. Check our laptop, see if there's any new messages. I'm not playing that game again. Oh, wait, there was one. I was so sure there wouldn't be that I clicked off. <laughs> B emailed us. Oh, and Greg emailed us. Hey, that was fun. Let's do that again sometime. You are pretty handy when it comes to breaking stuff. I'm sure there's a job in there somewhere. Yeah, it's called demolition. You can actually get a job doing that. Holy shit, I found my calling. I'm glad I could help facilitate this. So I looked up people. Oh, so I looked up people who attract insects. Seems to come down a lot to heat and various odors. 
They can't get enough of this. Yeah, I guess not. Good night, May. Night. Hey, punk. What you do tonight? Oh, I got trapped in a basement. Beat up a furnace? Right on, man. Night, night. All right, we're not going to play the guitar. We are just going to go to bed. Yes. Maybe if I did it more, I'd be better at it. But, you know, that's the paradox. I don't actually want to do it. Oh, we're dreaming. I like the dreaming part. It's cool. Let's see what our dream's going to be about tonight. Oh, look at this. What's happening here? I don't know. Let's see if we can get this dream done before we run out of time. Oh, I think I might have to go down to the beginning. I think I'm getting ahead of myself here. Are there stairs right there? I can't see anything in this dark dream. We'll go down instead of going up. I was getting a little tricky because all the up stuff was the stuff I missed last time. Turning the lights on, baby. Oh, are we having the same dream? Okay, we got the euphonium guy. I mean, I like this dream, but yeah. Be cool to have a different dream. Not exactly the same, I don't think. <laughs> hey, VJ! I need, you know, you doing that when you come in in the morning has made me realize I need to put my commands up. I command you, I am having fun, man. I like these music dreams. Just gotta figure out where we need to go. All right, we had that one. Definitely go check out VJ for some walkabout. Walkabout is awesome. Oh, here's accordion guy. Ah! Oh no, that's as far as I can go. Okay, so I think we got everybody going this direction. Just grooving, man. Just grooving. Uh, so VJ was VJ4 that I said hi to over on the Rendered Reality Discord. Was that you? <laughs> I'm hoping. <laughs> like man of course if this isn't bj then it'll just seem like i'm being very friendly and like the discord ambassador all right we got our violin ah okay bj fours you know i have to say i always have said it because i am not very observant i've always said it bj's other name and disregarded the four i never noticed the four until just now <laughs> All right, that's the end of that side. Oh, too short. It was too short. Well, VJ's other VJ Four's other name is interesting too. Sorry, I didn't mean that to trail off like I didn't mean it. I was trailing off because I was trying to pay attention to what I was doing here. Another light. Oh, look, now we're like out on the dock. Oh, so our goal is the same to get all the musicians. It's inter. <laughs> oh, Sonny, that's a smart one. BJ4 all spelled out, man. 
Okay, there's our sax guy. So we got the same musicians, but it's a different landscape, basically. We're grooving, man. We're grooving. Is that, did we get all of them? I meant to pay attention to how many musicians we have. Oh, okay. 9.5. That's her Discord. Oh, I never heard of that before. What does she do, Sunny? Is she a crafty, a crafting twitcher? I only ask that because I know you watch a lot of crafting streams. Huh. Wow. Ah. Oh. I'll have to check her out. All right, I don't remember where the... All right, I guess maybe I don't... I haven't found it on this one. Another streamer I follow, K of Double K, is having this big, long um, fundraising stream right now. He's doing like a... Uh, what is it called? The scroll one. Let me look, because I'm lurking over there. Elder Scrolls Skyrim. He's doing this Skyrim stream that's... In fact, we might raid over to him when we're done here. Uh, he's kind of he, he's kind of loud, but he's funny. Um, and it's a fundraiser. He's a UK streamer, so he's not usually on when we're on. He's usually... I get him early in the morning when I wake up, and then he's usually off by the time we're done. So we might raid over to him when we're finished. See who all's on. He's definitely not as chill as we are, but uh, I do kind of like him. All right, I don't know where we're supposed to go to like finish up. I feel like I missed something. Okay, that's the end. It seemed like with the other one, like this, you had to, it was like a central location, wasn't there, that we ended up at and that made it finish. The Blood Red Moon. I wonder if we didn't get all the instruments. I feel like I've been everywhere. Oh, look at this high up one. Have I been up there? I don't know. Let's go up there and see. Yeah, the light's on. Oh, this is where I went at the very beginning when I said I would go down instead of up. But we'll go up here and see. Yeah, that's the top. Oh! It's a dream, so I don't think we can die. <laughs> huh. What's the end? I mean, I do like these, but I'm kind of ready for this to be over. We're getting to like end of our time and I want to come out of the dream before I end. What'd you have for breakfast, Sonny? Getting hungry, so I'm thinking about breakfast. And I was lazy and I did not go to the grocery store, so my normal flaxseed meal muffin and a grapefruit that I have for breakfast every day. I didn't go to the store, so I'm out of grapefruit. So I'm probably gonna have to have flaxseed meal muffin and a red bell pepper for breakfast, which I admit is a little strange. And then make myself go to the store after the stream and not play No Man's Sky like I usually do. No Man's Sky is taking over my whole life. Let me just say, it's the truth. Oh, come on! How do we get out of here? I hadn't seen any point. I think this is where the water is down here. I hadn't seen any point in this one that was like the... a kind of end point. OK, 
Okay, that's as far as I can go that way. Hmm. I'm just saying, you guys, we are going to go until we get out of this dream. <laughs> I don't know what, how long that's going to be, but hopefully not too long. I have this flaxseed meal muffin every morning that I make. It's one of those uh, things you make in a in a mug. So it's called muffin in a minute. I've been having it every morning for breakfast for years. Super healthy. Tastes pretty good, or at least I've gotten used to it. But man, it's a lot better with a grapefruit. Man, how do I get out of the dream? Wake up, May, wake up. It's time to wake up. Where did I not go, I wonder? I can't go that way down. I think the end of the last one. Oh yeah, we got that bear that came, but I don't know where to get him activated. I don't know where I haven't been yet. Which, you know, makes sense on its face, right? I mean, we got all these lights lit, so surely I've been to all these places. Here's the moon. Oops. Dude, where do we go? I want the dream to be over. I know I just said when we got here how much I like the dream part, which I do, but I'm ready for it to be finished now. <laughs> I might have to look this up, you guys. It seems crazy, but... We're just going back and forth. Let's see if we can go towards the moon more. The moon seems like important and kicking off the. Yeah, I haven't cheated at all, VJ. Hey, and good on remembering the con the command, man. That's the first time. But I think we're gonna maybe have to have a cheat a cheat one because I do not know where I'm supposed to go. Huh, I wonder if there, what was that blue thing that we just sailed past? Yeah. Oh, the high cheating score? <laughs> well, I have to say, not patting myself on the back at all. This game uh, doesn't really require, oh, it was the euphonium player. That was the blue thing we sailed past. Uh, doesn't really require cheating. Or it hasn't before now. I think we got the whole band. Dang. Wait, what's that? I was hoping those, like, fireworky looking things back there were going to become the end. We need our friend Charlie, who was here yesterday, who had played this game before, to tell us what to do here.
I don't think it would be at the back at the beginning. Moon is cool looking. Okay, here's some more sparkly bits. I'm not entirely sure how a walkthrough is even going to say, like, go back to the sax player and then turn left or, like, what? <laughs> I get up on that. I've been up there before, clearly, because there's the light lit. Make one more round and then we're gonna look it up. Yeah! Okay, tell me something. Maruski, tell me something. I hope it's that you looked it up and you know the answer. <laughs> Okay, well, were you, while you type in whatever you want to tell me, I'm going to look up uh, the answer to this. Let's see. I, don't count me a cheat until I actually get it. Night in, until I get the cheat, I mean. Night in the woods. Uh, second band dream. So I said, Night in the Woods, second band dream finish. <laughs> I want to get out of here. Trouble getting through dream sequence two. Uh, what? You know, I know that that, uh, so I've tried that, that I can call him, but you can only call him if you've got him in that system, if you have a thing like a, a, a pod, in the system somewhere. So you can't just call him anywhere in any system, wherever you are. He, he won't come. It'll say you don't have a pod for him in this system. I have tried it. If you're watching tonight, we'll do it. And then you can see. Because I, uh, I have tried that. I'm in the second dream sequence with the four musicians. Have to navigate rooftops. Found all four. Explored the whole map. I don't see where to go. Oh yeah, we haven't seen those uh, light things. And you can't just build a pod. Like, you build the pod and then you have to call him. And then once you've done that, then you can call him anywhere in the, in the area. I'll find a screenshot. Okay, those posts we haven't seen. Wait. Top left corner of the map, if that helps. The posts won't appear unless you jump on those two random ledges. Wow, okay, so there's something up in the upper left. I'm going to turn my brightness up. Give me a secy. So I can actually see. Yeah, definitely a cheat there. Definitely a cheat there. And based on this thread that I'm reading, uh, it's not, I'm not the only person who couldn't figure it out. So that thing, which I remember now on the other, from the other one of these we did with the four posts that light up as you find the band, there's some, something up here where those posts are. So we definitely don't want to rage quit this game. 
but we might have to quit for the morning. And if I do that, I'll probably find it off stream because I don't want to be so tedious for y'all. He said it was in the upper left somewhere, so let's see how high we can get going that direction. I might have to like watch a YouTube or something. All right, so here's our euphonium player. Actually, hold on. This guy posted a, a link to a screenshot, which I didn't think would be very helpful, but let me look and see what it is. Uh, no, continue. Geez, oh, Pete, that isn't too helpful. Oh, you know, back at the very beginning when I was jumping up that little ledgy thing, it looks like that. And I said, oh, no, I need to get on with it before I do this. Okay, I'm going to do one more little run through here because I really did want to finish this part for the end of the stream. I can't remember where that was exactly. Oh, right here. There's some ledges. I wonder if it is right here. Okay. Oh, I see. This is kind of crazy, I have to say. All right, now he's in some junk. Here we go. All right. Dang. Oh, a second raccoon, Sonny, but no armadillo yet. Man, creepy squirrel. Uh, wow, so are they going to come? I guess they'll come get the raccoon, but is your week uh, almost over of trapping? And what happens if they don't get, uh, they don't get the armadillo in a week? Inquiring minds want to know what happens next. Phew, you guys. We never would have gotten that. If I hadn't have brightened up my screen and read the cheat, I'm, I'm going to take that cheat, yeah, and say we couldn't have done it without. So I'm not feeling bad about that. Uh, okay, we're going to wait a minute for Sunny to tell us her story while I am doing my outro. Uh, also, I want to see... Let me get my... my, my uh, picking up the raccoon now. My week... Oh, so you still have a few days. But what does happen if they don't get the armadillo by the end of the week? Isn't that kind of on them for not having caught him properly all right let me see if kwk is still on oh i think that's kind of bad honestly uh okay you guys we're gonna raid over to kwk who's playing skyrim uh he's doing a charity stream like i said he's a little bit loud but i hope you like him uh, anyway, thank you so much for hanging out with me this morning. I appreciate it. I'll be back at 4 p.m. Yeah, we have a lot of raccoons here, too. It's what happens when you live in the woods, right? Uh, I'll be back at 4 p.m. Central this afternoon with some No Man's Sky. Uh, and then tomorrow morning, we'll be back at 7.30 a.m. with this game again. I need to look up how average, how long this game is so that I can... Yeah, add new and by the bio, right? Uh, so that I'll know more or less what we're looking at. I uh, hope you guys have a great Friday. Hope to see you again. If I don't see you uh, this weekend again, I hope you have a great weekend. It's been lots of fun. This game is interesting, bringing back a lot of not necessarily great high school memories. <laughs> uh, let's go say hi to K Double K. Bye, everybody.